Many of us take healthcare access for granted. We can actually make an appointment with our doctor. We may even be able to get a doctor online or over the phone. But the challenges of accessing healthcare when you're living in the jungle and working in the forest is difficult. We found that some of the forest guards had to travel large distances to access healthcare in the event of a snake bite or if they had an accident or if they were having chest pain. So what we did is we did preventative health checks on forest guards and our data has been staggering. We found that large numbers were undiagnosed diabetics. We found people that had high blood pressure, who were obese, had high cholesterol. So through our engagement with forest guards and the forest departments, we've actually using preventative health measures to improve the health, to prevent diseases like diabetes, blood pressure, and even mouth cancer, which is secondary to high levels of tobacco chewing and betel nut chewing on safari. So these are some of the things where WCT has taken the lead globally and actually trying to understand the health of forest staff and trying to develop interventions to mitigate this health. One of the things that we are about to launch is a bespoke health app for forest staff where a member of the forest team can actually download the app and actually get all sorts of useful health resources in terms of what to do in an emergency. Also, uh, and in addition to preventative health information on how to stay healthier in the field. We also have built in a feature where it tells them where their nearest health facility is in case of an emergency. On the occasion of World Rangers Day, we at WCT are pleased to launch our One Arogya mobile application, which is focused on the healthcare needs of the frontline forest staff. It is an Android-based mobile application developed by Wildlife Conservation Trust in collaboration with the Tulsi Foundation. The app is available in multiple languages and has a secure and friendly user interface. As the forest staff works and lives in remote forest areas, the app is designed to function in low network areas and all its resources can also be downloaded. The app with its distinctive components will not only make essential healthcare resources available to the frontline forest staff, thereby educating and helping them to take proper steps to improve their health, but will also assist in collecting reliable and accurate data to understand and comprehensive guide further interventions. We hope that this app will go a long way in improving the health and safety of the frontline forest staff. WCT are putting health at the heart of conservation where it belongs and we look forward to doing more work to keep frontline safe which in fact will keep the forest safe which will in turn keep the tigers safe 